Hello awesome viewers, how are you all? Welcome back to another video. Guys, in this video we are going to discuss how can we convert multiple sheet excel file into html. This is one of the question asked by the viewer. Lesina, if I have more sheets, I want to view all the sheets data. Okay, do that. This was asked in this video, convert excel to html table using JavaScript. I will put the link of this video on the top right hand corner so that you can guys can watch. So in this video we are doing exactly that. So if I click on this multi sheet data type, excel is file. So we have two sheets here. We will convert this data and to html so that in one html file we can see the all sheet data. Without any further ado, let us start the video. So now guys, let us start the program. So I'll write var xlsx equal to where I need xlsx library. So before that, I'll take uh, var data file, where data and temporary are the two variables which I'll be using in the program. After this, I'll be writing var fs and it file system object. So I'll write require, I'll write fs. So after this, we'll take we need the path of an excel so i'll write var excel file equal to excel file which we have that is multi sheet data dot xlsx so this is the sheet if the sheet is present on the same folder so we can directly give this if it is present different folder you can give the complete path now here so i have to read the file so i'll write var workbook equal to xlsx dot I'll get read file read file of what file I read excel file now here we have to get the names what are the sheet names I'll write sheet names equal to wb dot sheet names wb dot sheets sheet names so just I'll give you an idea. I'll put console.log of sheet names. So multi Excel to HTML. So we have two sheets here. So now you are getting the logic right. So now we can use a, a loop here. We can use a loop to manipulate the data to add all the sheet data into one HTML file. What I'll do here, I'll take a temporary variable which I've already defined top. So, which I have declared here, I am giving a definition here. I am giving temp as a null value, nothing else. So, I will write for loop. I will write var. So, i equal to 0, i less than sheet names dot length. So, sheet names are 2. So, sheet names dot length I need. So, length. Now, I will do i plus plus. Simple basic. Uh, so, here I will give data equal to xlsx. That is available which I have used in top xlsx dot utils dot sheet to html. Here what we have to do typically we'll give sheet names, but we'll give like this wb dot sheets of inside an array. I'll give sheet names of i. And what I'll do, I'll do here temp equal to temp plus data. That's it. Now all I'll do. I will try to read the temp variable. So fs dot write file. Here I want to write a file. So I'll write convert and html dot html. I can write converted excel to html. So here I have to pass data. That will be a temporary variable. Here I'll write an error function. I can write function of err. Here you can write open right close bracket. Here I'll give console.log file is created. So here file should be created now. So I'll run the same thing. So file is created. You can see converted Excel where you see. I have to go on the top. So yeah, what is HTML you can see here. So now I am I'll open this converted Excel to HTML. So let me open click on C convert Excel to HTML. You can see. ABC123 is the first sheet data. 
DEF456 in second sheet data. Sheet 1 data is ABC123. Sheet 2 data is DEF45. Hope you have liked the video guys. If you like the video, please click on like. If you are a new viewer, please click on subscribe. Till then guys, take care. Have a great day. Bye-bye.